With control claimed in the Logar province, the Taliban have captured 15 provincial capitals in their violent push for power. The terrorist group says that it has captured the Afghan city of Lashkargah. It is a city in the southwestern part of Afghanistan and the capital of Helmand province. Lashkargah is the latest to fall following a string of attacks unleashed by the Taliban. This comes after the Taliban claimed to capture Kandahar and Herat. And according to sources, military and government officials had evacuated the city after striking a deal with the terrorists. Kandahar, which is the second largest city in Afghanistan, is also in the Taliban's control as of now, which means that only the capital, Kabul, and other minor pockets of territories are left in the Afghan government's control. A Taliban spokesperson tweeted about the fall of the city and said that Kandahar is completely conquered. This comes after the third largest city, the oasis of Afghanistan, also fell to the Taliban. The government security forces had to withdraw to prevent further destruction. The Taliban spokesperson has tweeted the latest victory over the city of Herat. All provincial buildings, including the governor's office, police headquarters and other facilities have been taken over completely. These are the visuals coming from Herat after Taliban's capture. The government armoured vehicles can be seen retreating from the area and these are the visuals of the police headquarters in Herat. The Taliban have hoisted their flag over the police headquarters. Dozens of military vehicles, weapons and ammunition have fallen into the hands of terrorists. The city was under siege for weeks. The Afghan army, veteran warlords, even civilians, fighters could not hold the city for too long. The terrorists tore through the city's defense lines. They moved through the streets, battled the government forces and closed the highways and airport. It was just a matter of less than four days for the Taliban to overturn the Afghan troops. The capture of the biggest provincial capitals represents Taliban's biggest military victory since they began their offensive in May this year. And next on the terror group's target is Kabul. Our correspondent Anis Malik has been getting us all the latest updates from the heart of the conflict. Listen in to the latest development. Well, the Taliban continue with their advances and they now have claimed uh, five provincial capitals in the past 24 hours. Uh, the first two fell yesterday was the province of Ghazni, uh, which is 150 kilometers to east of Kabul. Then we saw the fall of Badris province. Its capital, Kilaidnaw, was overrun by the Taliban. It was previously also claimed to have been overrun, but it was taken back by the forces. Badris also borders Turkmenistan in one of its districts, that is the Mokkar district. Then we saw in the evening uh, uh, claims by the Taliban of the fall of Kandahar to them. Uh, they put out videos. After that, we saw the fall of Herat and over the Taliban overrunning the, uh, the district of Gozara, which houses the Herat airport and the UN office as well. After that, very late last night, we saw the claim of them uh, taking over Lashkirgat, the capital of Helmand province. Uh, and uh, the government says that they, are, they would want to put up a fight. Uh, they are putting up a fight rather. The, the people here in Kabul uh, uh, expect the government to put up a fight. There is a growing sense of insecurity. Uh, the government in the past 24 hours has claimed to have killed more than, 20, uh, more than three 300 plus Taliban men, a claim that has been rebutted by the Taliban spokesperson. Anas Malik in Kabul, Afghanistan for Vyond World is One. Vyond World is One is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news updates on the move.